Hello everybody on YouTube, Sonic Waffles here, and today you're watching a lovely, flawless gameplay on Modern Warfare 3. Today we're playing a little bit of TDM on the map, Dat Dome. And today I've got some lovely tips for you, actually. Uh, you guys know that I'm not a big fan of really high scoring gameplays just because I don't get them a whole lot. Some people are just really good at getting those AC-130s really quick and uh, playing ground war and getting 90 kills in one game, but uh, I'm not very good at that, and I'm a little bit better at getting something more consistent, which is why I think normally my my, my stats kind of show that, where uh, my, my KDR and win-loss ratio are pretty close, and they're pretty stagnant. They don't move at all. But uh, before I go into those tips, I would first like to say that recently I've been trying to play a little bit more Call of Duty. In fact, the past two days I've played a couple hours of it. And uh, I've been having a pretty rough time, but I'm going to tell you how I just solved my problem. And it started with a few games of TDM. So, as you know, I'm more of an objective player. I like playing Kill Confirmed and Domination. Domination is my favorite, okay? If I, if I chose my favorite game mode, it would probably be Domination. But Kill Confirmed is also pretty high up there. So, they're both objective games. And, as you know... I'm an objective player. I like doing that kind of thing because I like winning. Now, a lot of people do like to kill horn those game modes and they kind of make me angry, but you know what? You just got to deal with those kind of people. So whenever I wanted to get back into Call of Duty and have fun on it, because I have fun on Call of Duty by doing really good, and I got lucky here. I know. I know. I only get lucky about twice in this game. Um, but uh, if you ever want to do good in Call of Duty and just have some fun, First things you need to do is get into TDM because a lot of times, or at least for me, and I know some of my friends, like my good friend Odd Job, I know I I know he's listening. He's a good friend and listens to my videos, but I know that he's also an objective player. And if he killed Tor during a domination game, he would feel bad, and that's how I would feel. So the first thing you need to do is play TDM because if you do end up camping and only get 15 kills and two deaths, then you're not going to feel bad because you actually did the objective. So you did help win for your team, and you didn't just sit there and think about yourself. So play TDM and clear your conscience. Now, the second thing you need to do is use a comfort gun. I'm using the SCAR-H today. You can use the ACR or any other assault rifle that you're very comfortable with. If you are comfortable with the shotgun, you could try it, but chances are you're not going to get good scores like these. You're going to get something a little bit closer to a, uh, a low 2 KDR or something like that, and it's not going to be as successful. But use whatever comfort gun that you like. It's something that you're very used to and you're familiar with. So uh, whatever you like. Now, the next thing you need to do is hack, uh, as some people say. Or you need to basically cheat cover. Um, a lot of people, even in TDM, a lot of skill in TDM is being able to run out in the open and actually get a good KDR in the game, made, in the game mode without taking a bunch of cover, without hiding and sitting in a corner. But as you can see in this gameplay, I think I just did it right there. I was up next against that wall and just barely peeking out from around it. I did the best I could to make sure that none of my body was exposed. Now, a lot of times that's cheap, but remember, you're wanting to have fun and do good. So you want to get a good successful game, game play like this, then you need to do something like that and hack or cheat. And that's all it takes. Now, this is the first game of TDM that I did, and hey, I went 25-0, so maybe it'll work for you. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and as always, have a good one. 